Hello friends, welcome back to Pen Delight. This video is on the Chennai Pen Show that happened on 8th, 9th and 10th of March 2024. I have attended the Chennai Pen Show on 9th March and it was such an amazing experience. We can see the board that are displaying more than 50 brands and sellers who are presenting their pens and pen accessories. I can say it's a pen festival for the pen enthusiasts and not just pen show. It's definitely a pen festival because there are so many visitors today and the hall was fully crowded and I struggled a lot to cover all the stalls properly. The arrangements were well planned and the ambience of the hall also very good. There are more than 50 tables and this is the first one. This stall is by Schaefer's Pens. This stall is by Endless. They come up with a variety of books, accessories and inks. Here we can see Bina and V sign. These are some beautifully designed collection from Sculpture Series. This style is by Faces and Places. They bought some with good variety of papers, planners and lot of inks. It's a beautiful collection of huge variety of inks. Another table with beautiful Aurora collection. Now I am at Click Pen Stall. They displayed all the models Click N, Click Renaissance, Aristocrat, President, and every model. I reached the ASA store, good to see so many ASA collections in one place and happy to interact with Subramaniam sir. I am also excited to see all the lacquered pens physically today. This pen is with eggshell works and these are the ASA color all lacquered versions. I have purchased this nib there, it's one of my favorite nibs. And this was fitted to a CSPR model. 
visitors are increasing and it's very interesting to see these many people attending the pen show this stall is by online mantra datin they bought many branded premium pens and inks We can see so many varieties of Opus 88 here. A good collection of Pelican inks and even more good collection of Pelican pens. This is one of the popular collectible edition from Opus Pens. This is an eyedropper fountain pen and it comes with a safety valve. Now I am with the Stax Pens. Copper and brass pens of Stax Pens are very popular and they are also popular for their limited edition pens. I have posted a small exclusive video for the Stax Pens collection and I have shown the limited edition pins also in that. You can see with the given link. And these beautiful and colorful fountain pens which are in acrylic and metal are from Wazir Pens. In this Chennai pen show, Wajir Pens also introduced some new collection of fountain pens. Now along with the acrylic, they have very good collection of resin and celluloid pens too. This Kaweco collection also from Wazir Pens. Now I am at Kiko Pens table. I have seen many people giving very good feedback about the Kiko Pens and yes they are really very good. Most of them are question fillers. The design specifications and colors also very attractive. I feel we should definitely have one Kiko Pen in our collection. Now I am with Ranga Pens. As usual they come with mind blowing amazing pens, huge variety of exclusive ebonite shades, every pen looks like a masterpiece here. Compared to the previous Bangalore show they bought considerably more variety of stock in Chennai show. Recently they introduced copper, brass and aluminum pens also. But I didn't get a chance to capture them in this video. But you can see my video on brass pen posted on my channel with the given link. The newly launched Peak Material pens are special attraction today here. Peak Material is one of the strongest material. And Ranga Pens is the first one who introduced Peak Material pens in India.
Ranga pens recently launched resin make pens also. The shade and quality of these resin pens are absolutely amazing and they are very less in weight. This style is by Liquid Pens, another excellent brand who makes metal pens in very economical prices. Liquid Pens are best value for money and I have made an exclusive video for the Liquid Pens you can see with the given link. Pen Club is another excellent place for many premium branded pens. They have almost every brand of pens. That's why they say in their tagline, you name it and we have it. We can get most of the premium brands at Pen Club. Another style for vintage pens. In this pen show, there are two vintage pen sellers. Vintage collection at this style looks more and interesting. This table is by Aish Paper. Needless to mention that most of the fountain pen enthusiasts knows and uses this Aish Paper. I am with Tejura Overseas now, another best reliable seller for multi-branded premium pens. This is the newly launched special premium pen from Hero Pens. There is a special counter for Krishna inks. I have taken a Moonweave ink here. It comes with a beautiful sheen. We can also see the newly launched Helica pens here. I want two pens and one can see the detailed review of these Helica pens with the given link. I reached Magna Carta stall now. One more exciting place because this is the first time I am seeing this Magna Carta pens physically, especially the Mag 6 and Mag 1000 models. I am also curious to see and write with their number 10 nib. Number 10 nib comes with MAC 1000 which is the world's largest nib till now. I tried that nib but I forgot to capture that in this video. This is a MAC 1000 model made with cellulite. This stall is by 3PW, a newcomer in the pen industry with an innovative concept of 3D printing pens. They print the fountain pens and pen accessories with 3D printer. 
I have already posted an exclusive video on these 3D pens. It's an interesting video. Please watch that video with this given link. Now I am at Del Moon Pens counter, again one of my favorite pens. They came from Delhi to Chennai all over with their huge amazing stock. Del Moon Pens are best if you want some very unique shape or a different kinds of handcrafted works. This is called Steampunk model, it's very popular. They do excellent Urushi work and Roden works. They take more than 1 to 2 months to complete the Urushi work and Roden works on their pens. These are the gold filled pens. They do laser engravement on the pens and fill the gold with hands. These are all the special pens with all eggshell work, mother of peril and rodan works, are our special attraction and eye catcher to these Delmoon pens. There is some bad lighting impact here, the shadow is disturbing this video. There is another special pen. Hanuman Chalice is laser engraved on this pen and the text is hand filled with all the gold. Now I am with the stall of inks and pens. They are from Pune and many fountain pen enthusiasts know them well. Their pen store in Pune is a must visit place for many fountain pen lovers. In today's show they displayed multi branded fountain pens. We can see so many lotus pens also here. These are the handmade lacquer pens from Urushi Studio. I am seeing physically first time these Urushi Studio pens here. This stall is by Penhouse Dartin, one of the largest website for exclusive stationery. They also have huge varieties of pens. Recently, Penhouse Dartin started one more pen stall and they claim it as the largest stationery shop in Chennai. This stall is by Acryl Pens. Acryl Pens are popular with the concept of recycled acrylic pens and they are also specialized in titanium nibs. Their premium pen storage looks interesting. Let's see in detail. So this is our uh, 36 pen leather case and it's got all these brass buckles on it and you can store 12 pens per tray and then in the back side we've got this velcro so in case you want to display your pens and use it as a stand you can do that. Yeah. This stall is by Suleka Inks. They came from Kolkata. Happy to see them here. And finally, I am at Candred Stall. They display all their varieties of pens.
I am curious to see the 9 size nib with Canrite Memo jumbo size pen. This is the Mammoth and it's really huge. And this 9 size huge nib with such a large ebonite feed is just amazing. And look at this large capacity piston filling converter. One more interesting news, Canrite is launching their music nib soon. It comes with 3 times. This will be the first music nib from India. It's a great news for Indian flex nib lovers, but still it is very stiff and hard. So that's all about Chennai show, I finished to cover all the stalls by evening and everywhere it is fully crowded, by evening no place to stand properly and it was so difficult to capture all the stalls and all the pen models. I missed many models to capture in this video. And I am happy to see most of the Indian pen makers participated in today's show. By evening 6 pm when we are coming out from the show there are a lot of people waiting at the registration counter. We can make out how successful is this show. That's why we can say this is a pen festival. Thanks for watching this video till the end.